Good morning, Liu. Good morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. Hey, um... What is it, Liu? We should get ready to go. Okay. We can talk more on the way. Hey, um... Yes? It's time to make our way to the village. Got it. We can talk more on the way. Hey, um... What is it, Liu? We should get ready to go. Got it. Let's get moving. Stay out. Leo, let's go. Yeah. Your house is pretty far from the village, huh, Shenhua? Oh, yes, I suppose you're right. Is there a reason for that? The quarry could be one. Sorry? The quarry. It's a special one that even I'm not allowed to enter. Ah. So, your house is there to protect it? Yes, I believe so. Father didn't tell me anything about it, though. I see. Do you know what the dragon and phoenix in the quarry were for? No, I don't. But your father carved them, right? Yes, he must have. He wasn't alone, though. What do you mean by that? They must have taken generations to complete. So, you think your grandfather worked on them, too? Yes, possibly even further back than that. Have you heard any stories about them? Not a single one. My father always said he'd tell me when I got older. Then how do you know it has so much history? Well, everyone in the village has history. The villagers? Yes, generations of stonemasons, hunters, and farmers have all lived here. The same goes for the cattle wranglers. They've been here for ages. Oh yeah? That's just how things work here.
Is this a dojo? That's right. This is Marshall Hall. It's been here for ages. Marshall Hall? Long ago, many great martial artists traveled here from all over the world. But no one comes here nowadays. Is that so? Ryo, you should come here to practice when you have time. Is that okay? Of course. Our doors are open to everyone that comes here looking to master the martial arts. Are you a new trainee? Sorry? Hmm, you're Japanese. I am. The people of Bailu Village have trained here for centuries. It has history. Did you say centuries? You would do well to train here if you have lost sight of the path. You can polish your techniques. So you'll let me train here? Not only that, I'll let you prove yourself by fighting the monks here. You're on. A fight? Very well. Your first opponent shall be Red Tiger. He is our least skilled monk, but do not underestimate him. say you will you join us yes absolutely very well what is your name Ryo Hazuki I shall have a name tag prepared for you you will start from the lowest rank rank yes you must fight and defeat someone above your rank in order to move up you must train day in and day out to improve your kung fu Whose shop is that? Over the bridge. Oh, it belongs to Uncle Tao. Uncle Tao, huh? Yes, people can get anything they need from his shop. I see. Leo, did you pack anything to eat? Why do you ask? Well, you can't run on an empty stomach. That's a very good point. Be sure to keep a little something on hand in case you get hungry later. A lot of places in the village sell food, too. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind.
Leo, this herb. This is... It's licorice. You can make Chinese medicine with it. So, you can turn this into medicine, huh? Not just this. There are lots of herbs growing in Bailu. Where do they grow? They're all over the place, but you have to really look for them. Oh, really? There should be special maps at Uncle Tao's shop. Someone actually made maps? Yes, if you find enough to make some medicine. Uncle Tao will buy them from you. Okay, I'll have to keep that in mind. Guess I'll go after Shenhua. I would like to know. What's the tall tower just past the village square? Ah, uh, yes. That's the bell tower. What is it for? We ring the bell if there's a fire in the mountains, or if something dangerous is encroaching on the village. Is that why it's so tall? Precisely. It's also a useful landmark, because you can see it from anywhere in the village. That's handy. So, you can find your way back to the square? If you head for the bell tower? That's right. I'll have to keep that in mind. I need help with something. No, not right now. Anyway, I have to practice my forms. Please, Zhang Ping. It's important. Oh, hi, Shenhua. Hey, mister. Who are you? This is Liu. He's a friend of mine. Did you see the thugs that came to the village? Nuh-uh. If you know anything, please tell us. Oh, wait a minute. Mei Ling said that they came to her house when she was sleeping. Mei Ling said that? Okay, let me go ask her. Mei Ling is Wang Wen's kid. They live nearby. Okay then. Oh, thanks. Excuse me. Oh, hey kid. What do you want? Have you come to apprentice under me? Oh, uh, nothing. You're a beginner, right? You have a name? Ryo Hazuki. Well, Ryo, it's your lucky day. Fear not, for I am the great Suza Xiong. I can forge a formidable master out of the most hopeless of pupils. You stand before a Chun Tai cheer master. Um, yeah, I'm good. Thanks. What? You don't think I've got what it takes? That's not what I... Then let me show you what I've got! Fight me! Right now! Oh, man. Look, I'm not opposed, but... It's too late now, R It was Ryo, right?
Thanks for that. Well, how's it feel? Pretty nice to train with a master like me, isn't it? Hmm? Uh, sure. Come by any time. I'm always up for a fight. Hi, Zhishong. Good timing, bud. I was just starting to get bored. Let's spar. Now's not a good time. Wow, way to kill my buzz. Oh well, next time. Sorry. I need help with something. Are you well, Ling? Oh, hi, Shenhua! I see. So you two are friends. Did you see any thugs come here? The people who messed up your house. Nuh-uh. Okay, then. Excuse me. You're not from around here, are you? You're a thug. This is a friend of mine. Um... Is that right? Have you seen the thugs that came to the village recently? Word has it they showed up at the Wong household. But Wen's lips are sealed. Maybe she'd open up to you. It's worth a shot. Thank you very much. Just be careful, okay? She'd be heartbroken if anything were to happen to you. Huh? Who would be heartbroken? Shenhua, that's who! Actually, I... Oh dear. There I go running my mouth again. <laughs> okay then. <laughs> 